The Department of Environmental Management is now closely inspecting state parks and campgrounds for a destructive pest. The Asian longhorned beetle has infested wooded areas along the East Coast and it could mean losing thousands of trees. Arlen Media intern Natalie He has the details from Lincoln. If this invasive insect is not detected early, it could cause Rhode Island to lose thousands of trees and pose as a danger to state residents. Walking along the trails at Lincoln Woods State Park, DEM volunteers spent Thursday on the lookout for telltale signs of the Asian longhorn beetle. It's a glossy black pest with white spots, most easily recognized by their staple long antennas. It was imported with industry. Um, and because it has no natural predators, it just kind of took over. These beetles are not a direct hazard to humans, but the trees where they lay their eggs suffer as these inch-long beetles eat their way through the insides, leaving distinct exit holes that's easy for a trained eye to spot. If they go undetected for a long time because they would um, hop from tree to tree, and the only effective way of removing these beetles is to actually remove the trees. So the sooner we find them, the less trees they would infest and the less trees we would have to remove. In fact, massive outbreaks have led to the removal of around 27,000 trees in Worcester. Luckily, the DEM says none of these beetles have been spotted in the ocean state and hopefully stays that way. The biggest thing that we can stress is um, not to transport any firewood if you're going on vacation. And if you are coming from vacation, don't bring any firewood that you bought in another state back to Rhode Island. The DEM will be surveying the George Washington management area in Gloucester in about two weeks. Now they are still looking for more volunteers to help keep the Asian longhorn beetle out of Rhode Island. Reporting in Lincoln with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Natalie He, Eyewitness News.